Java Balls! Here we are. You guys have been screaming for this. It's another battle report by Java Balls and Fritz. It's been, Fritz has been over it's a been year been since we year. played. Believe it or not, uh, Fritz and I don't get to play every day. Uh, I moved farther away, so it's difficult for us to connect uh, with the Jawa baby and all. It's really just uh, team tournaments. Yeah. We play the conflict. Yeah. So uh, anyway, so we're playing here in a man cave. We're doing a, a live broadcast. There's uh, the U stream. There's the camera up there. So uh, you're gonna get this in two directions, guys. But uh, the game we're practicing for my tournament for I have coming up tomorrow. I'm playing my drop pod list. There's my pods, and um, right now it's pitched battle, uh, capture and control. So it's 12 inch deployment zone, capture the flag. His objective is that bone colored terminator or, or, or what's that a Warrior. Necron warrior over there. My objective is right here, this silver one. These are the ones I painted for my. Uh, my Necron painting set. And, um, yeah, so he, he run the roll, roll to go first, of course. I never win that roll. And he made me go first, of course. And uh, now he's deploying his forces. So he's throwing down his little uh, spiders and and dropping his... His things. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know. I, he's, got some, he's got some characters in his list. I don't know what they really do. Oh, my phone is ringing. All right. I okay, so I forgot to do video. So anyway, um, on my uh, first turn, I dropped five pods with five dreadnoughts coming at him. Uh, I'm going to lose a couple of these, but that's okay. So long as two survive, that's bad for Fritz. So um, here's what I got. I have a, a heavy support dreadnought with an assault cannon and heavy flamer. I've got a Furioso dreadnought, two Death Company dreadnoughts, and another Furioso. All four of those guys pop smoke. And that guy's actually going to shoot. I got seven of those scarab swarms lined up uh, with a heavy flamer. Yeah, I'm like, what? flamers. Nobody plays flamers in our group. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nobody see, brings flamers. Who brings flamers? Nobody. Um, okay, so uh, yeah, here we are. Uh, more to come. See. Yeah, conceivable for the blood angels coming out with the dreadnoughts. Fritz, by a freak of Fritz nature, despite the fact that he was rolling my dirty dice and uh, getting lots of lots misses, of ones. I've never lots had ones. so many ones. But it doesn't matter because he, he rolling that many dice, you're in, you're inevitably going to get some sixes to rend. And every time he got a six, he rolled the six on the rending yeah. roll. So uh, he made up for all those ones. So you know what that's from from playing Necrons for like a decade of the old codex where you to deal with vehicles you had to roll sixes yeah so so screw you fritz because you mobilize all three of those nasty dreadnoughts so now i have i have nothing to assault with uh over here he assaulted another furioso with two full 10-man uh scarab squads and the the furioso killed off the one of the squads but uh the other one got him and exploded him too so now uh, my dread my furiosos are all okay. done it's over. He I killed. Don't... He exploded another dreadnought over here too. Um, so yeah, it's toast. All right. Well, more to come. We'll see what happens next. Okay. So here we are. It's uh, game Ooh. two of the Fritz and Jawballs 40k fest, and uh, we are playing another practice game for my tournament tomorrow. He's got his Eldar Footdar list with uh, his, some Wraith Lords, Harlequins, and nastiness, and I'm playing my drop pods against him with my dreadnoughts. And um, the mission is kill points and table quarters, which will be one of the standard missions for tomorrow's tournament. I won, I won the roll to go first, and I gave it to Fritz. So he's now deploying yep. his Harlequins. Now, this is going to be an interesting game for me because I'm playing drop pods, of course, with dreadnoughts. And uh, so I got to land those dreadnoughts and survive all the fusion pistols and bright lances that he has. Which I think he'll do because he got smoke. Which, you know, with smoke, I should. I At least fun. a couple of my Dreadnoughts should survive. And then uh, then it's game on. We'll see what happens. I don't know how Harlequins will do. I don't know if... Like, they have their 5-plus save, and knowing Fritz, he'll make them all. So I'm probably just going to ignore the Harlequins and trust, just try to get to the meaty juice of his army. And let the Harlequins explode my drop pods and die in the uh, explosions. And um, that's my plan. Kill all the Pathfinders. With the dreadnoughts, just drop drop the pods next to the pathfinders, and uh, and the wraith lords assault the wraith lords. So we'll see. All right. And I and I got two more scarabs over there that I completely forgot about the whole game. <laughs> they blended in. 
Yeah, so that's uh, so that's it. The telling tale of this game was all of my dreadnoughts getting immobilized by lightning and goss weapons, just uh, just kept them out of the assault, yeah. and uh, and that's just that was bad. My scarabs uh, really didn't do anything. The scarabs, with the dreads. The, well, you killed two dreads with the killed scarabs, two, but lost his whole squad in return. Yeah, well, you, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, all, that's all you had to do. Uh, you don't have to lose. You, you don't have to lose a couple. You can lose a couple and still succeed. Acceptable losses. So that's it. I don't have any chance of uh, contesting his objective. It's that it's that flesh colored, the bone colored yeah. dreadnought there in the middle, and I can't get to it because uh, he's just going to either kill or. Or a kite those the yeah, company we'll, we'll, away. We'll separate Zon, uh, Stormlord and bring them there. Yeah. So then they have to run to there. Yeah. So uh, the it, best the best I could do would, you know, maybe maybe assault those guys away from the objective, in the middle. Because like I don't have to assault Zandrak. So if I rolled high enough, I if they survive the one guy, and he was there, I can move. Yeah, you, you I can move like as far as I can on you know past him and get I still have to assault that guy. You know, and then I could assault in. But that's if they survived all the shooting, which they probably won't. And I don't think you you'd whittle down those guys. And, and then he would still contest me over here. So that well, what the best I could do was if you didn't have your objective at all, and then mine was contested, it would still be a loss. It would still be a draw, right? It'd be a draw. But um. Yeah, I forgot that. Yeah, that just sucks, man. All all my dreadnoughts. Because every time, like, he didn't roll very well in the shooting, but it doesn't matter because he got at least one six yeah. every time. And every time he got that six, he got the six again on the rending to, to immobilize my dreadnoughts. I knew I just had to glance. I had to glance immobilize. You got to watch out for that Fritz luck because he's a dirty that cheater. Luck. And, that, and that's the Necrons. With the Necrons. And that happened to four of my dreadnoughts, man. The, the stupid, every time he got one glance through and rolled the six on the glance. Yep. So immobilize them all. And that's, that's craziness. I needed just one of those to get through and start assaulting stuff, and it would have wiped me out. And it would have got really nasty. So I'm gonna I'm gonna say that uh, I played the game well. That uh, as far as you know, just the the extreme luck went towards Fritz in that one. Um, I just needed one of my dreadnoughts to survive and go in there and start tearing it up. I think that I would have done okay. The only thing you forgot was your four stone. And then, and I library. forgot my my force my Over my here. my shield of Sanguinius from the librarian, but that didn't really matter. Um, it would have saved three of the guys, and then uh, it would have made the assault a little different. Did you drop the maximum number of dreads you could that turn? Yeah. So five, five. Six. You dropped six dreads turn. On the first turn, I dropped five dreadnoughts. Five, and that's the most. You that's can the drop. best I can do first turn. So anyway, that's wrapping up this game. Uh, we're gonna play another game or two today before we're yeah. done. So I'm gonna I'm gonna make this into one big long battle report with all the games. Cause I only shot like maybe five minutes of video total Eldar of this next. one. Eldar next, so we'll see. Eldar. But now we're gonna go cook some steaks. So um, all right, more to come in a bit. Fortune, these guys failed there, and you've got six dreadnoughts coming in. Five, five. Like that's fair. <laughs> <laughs> like you yeah. So this is the game. That's my side, and um. I won the roll to go first, and I gave it to Fritz, so he deployed over here in the corner, castling up yep. against all my pods. I put my uh, tactical squad over there with a priest and a librarian, and uh, they're just going to kind of hang yeah. out back there, because I, I don't want them anywhere near this nastiness, so yeah. they're going to just chill. And But I'm going to drop five dreadnoughts here against this thing, this squad. So I'm going to go ahead and roll the dice and drop these, these dreadnoughts and see what happens. I'll come back in a second. Kill points, by the way. Charge the Wraith Lords in. So look, look at this craziness here. I've got uh, <laughs> all five of my pods came down. One almost missed that, but it managed to save itself. And then, the, so I'm going to get out right now and just unload on these Harlequins point blank. And uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> so what's to shoot at? <laughs> so let's see. It's a shooting right. gallery. Uh, we should have hopefully some dying Harlequins real soon. And the best part is that you got to kill those uh, drop pods. Although, I mean, why would you not? They're kill points. But uh... you guys, want to know what I'm going to do? I'm going to rely on Jaw Balls missing critical rolls, rolling ones to wound, <laughs> missing melt shots. No, don't rely on that. That's, the, that's a good plan. That's the good plan. <laughs> all right, so let me open up all these doors, and then we'll uh, explosion. Get, two more squads ran off. It's going to come down to the Wraith Lords, man. Uh, what did I do to him? Arms off. Arms off. Blew this guy up here. I only killed one guy, and I mobilized. Mobilized and arms off another one. Now you Harley's got to make a leadership test. Yeah, they're gonna, and I'm probably gonna fail it the way I've been rolling. <laughs> let's roll that sucker now. Uh, let's do it. <laughs> I'm afraid to even roll this. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Two sixes. 
There it is. Goodbye. What is with these dice? Goodbye, Hardies. <laughs> Thanks off. for the kill point, sucker. Uh, so Jawa hasn't actually killed anything, but I've ran off the table three kill points. <laughs> what? This is great. Did you bring your army? Mm -hmm. Excellent. What kind of game is this? We're gonna get the Stout Smurf playing a game next time. These these, these shenanigans. Whew. I mean, but still, I mean, I, I've got three kill points, and you're gonna kill all my dreadnoughts with those wraith lords, man. Then kill all the pods. So you're gonna score ten kill points right there to my three. Right, this is it right here, man. Eldred. It's over. Eldred's running in. All right, more to come. I wouldn't. All right, do so this. I've been very bad with shooting video. But uh, so here's what happened up here in this corner. I dropped in my five dreadnoughts and I managed to kill off three harlequin squads with lots of fire and failing leadership tests. And uh, then he assaulted my dreadnoughts with wraith lords and Eldrad. He killed uh, he killed a couple and then you know on the charge and Eldrad killed one and blah 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 blah. The short of it is that he killed all all five of my first dreadnoughts and I killed uh, three harlequin squads and uh, a wraith lord. And over there I killed a scout squad. So. Um, so right now though, I've got nothing left to kill all that crap except one dreadnought and he's got five Fucking he's gonna kill all those drop pods and just total me on kill I, I want to assault your dude with Eldred. I yeah, well you, you want to go first. He's gonna die. You're gonna kill you him but... out those, uh, The other one dreads over there? Yeah, they're all dead yeah, well, let's, yeah, yeah. All right. We'll all right anyway, yeah. So, so the game the game is pretty much over. It's cooked because he's just gonna kill the pods at will and I can't, like, even if they explode, I can't hurt back. the Wraith Lords. Like a maniac. All right, so unless, unless I get really lucky with the Wraith Lord or my Dreadnought, it's over. More to come. Well, I mean, the best I can do is try and shoot those guys, but you'll get your cover saves. So this game is over. Uh, it started out awesome. I made a lot of elves run away um, and die. But uh, in the end, those Wraith Lords just popped the Dreads and uh, Eldrad killing Dreads. And now, so it's kill points, and those Wraith Lords are just going to punch all my pods and explode yeah. them all. So it's it's an over game. It was a lot of fun, and I definitely had a chance to take this game away from Fritz. Yeah. Um, it was it was either of our game up, up until this point. A couple of dice rolls, it could have gone my way just as easily as his, and uh, that's that's the way a game should be. So, um, I mean, there wasn't much I could have done. I, I had to throw them in there, and I had to go for it, and I really jumped out to a good start. And uh, a couple of lucky uh, dice rolls my way, and I really could have turned it around. It was it was the second turn with the assaults with the wraith lords. Yeah, that that yeah. one that one shot against the, the Furioso with the Eldrad, uh, if he would have killed where you kill where you killed Eldrad on that one shot on the assault, that that freed him up to go kill the other yeah. one instead of yeah, that that might have made a difference. Over here, you know they're gonna is that's that's the game. Well, well, yeah, my Harlequins did absolutely nothing. I ran them off the they table. They ran off the table. All three squads. Die, little elf bitches. <laughs> so the, the undead commanded by Eldred. You're anti elf. What is your issue? I hate elves. Yeah. elves. <laughs> well, I, Dungeons and Dragons. I, I, I hate elves. I don't. I will never play an elf in Dungeons and Dragons. I don't play it in D D and D online. Yeah. But in 40k, for some reason, he plays space elves. I play space elves. <laughs> like if, if guys found that out, they'd be like devastated. I'm like the ultimate elf fanboy. Well, and I can't stand them. <laughs> So that's wrapping up this game. Uh, Jowl Balls, 0-2 on the day against Fritz. Fritz just owning me on the tables. Um, so we'll see how, how my list plays out tomorrow at the tournament. Hopefully, I won't, hopefully I'll get just Space Marine, mecked space up Marines, Space Marines. Marines. You're, never like, gonna, you're never going to play all <laughs> I, yeah, I, I will not face this list ever. ever. And uh, I might see the, the Necron uh, Spider I think, Scarab I think list. See it. I think you'll see it tomorrow. But um, I'm calling you'll play at least one. I mean, it'll probably be there, but whether or not I see it, who knows. And, and that list, doesn't. it's not an instant kill, I don't think. Uh, I don't think. I think this list was better against mine than that Necron list. Because the Necron list, like, I could, if, if it... You get like the the mission worked in your favor, mission I think, out. and uh, I mean I really could have put a hurt on those on the scarabs. What what won the uh, Necron mission for me was that I immobilized your dreads. Yeah, you yeah, you got, yeah, that too. Scarabs tore up. You tore up my scarabs. Yeah, he got really lucky. I guess he immobilized all my dreadnoughts on the first turn. Yeah. And that's, <laughs> that's what uh, he like like because like he shot him and then he hits him. Then he has to roll a six to wound. So like he'd hit him like ten times, yeah. and he'd always get like one six. But then he had to roll another six, another six. To, to immobilize me. And I get those. Otherwise, I'm free.